Hey, good afternoon. It is a gorgeous day in Western Pennsylvania, and here are your headlines from your Pratt Pack in the Home Office on a Wednesday, May 2nd, 2018. From KDKRadio.com, the city of Pittsburgh is joining a lawsuit aimed at blocking the Trump administration from requiring citizenship information in the 2020 census. Also, the city of Pittsburgh is making a solid recovery from financially distressed status. The city controller's audit for 2017 since Pittsburgh ended the year with a $17 million surplus. Total debt was $416 million, down by $10 million. Harold Borstein, who was Donald Trump's personal doctor for decades, acknowledges that his over-the-top statement about the president's health in 2015 was not written by him, but by then-candidate Trump. Borstein's admission to CNN yesterday comes as he also said publicly for the first time to NBC News, that Trump's one-time bodyguard and two others raided his office in New York last year and took all of his medical files on the president. The Boy Scouts of America are on a quest to be the scouting organization for boys and girls, announcing it will drop the boy from the name of its signature program. The Navy has halted its practice of announcing the names of commanders relieved for poor performance or misconduct, a step back from the transparency the service had championed and a move that comes in the wake of one of the worst bribery scandals in Pentagon history. Sports, Penn's got goals from Jay Ginzel, Patrick Cornquist, and Sidney Crosby, but it was Alex Ovechkin's goal in 1853 of the third period that broke the tie and gave the Capitals a 4-3 win. They lead the series two games to one. Game four tomorrow night in Pittsburgh at seven. You can watch it on the NBC Sports Network. Bucks got beat 12-4 by the Nationals. Max Scherzer got the win. He's now 6-1 on the year. Pirates Washington again tonight in the nation's capital. You can hear it at 7.05 on 93.7 The Fan. Good afternoon.